In this gray log feature video, I wanted to go over dashboards. Dashboards are ways to visually represent your data through different graphs and charts. In order to start on creating a dashboard, if you go up to your menu item with dashboards and then go to create a dashboard, you'll be able to select and title what you want this to be called. So I'm gonna call mine a firewall overview and then give it a description, you know, firewall data. Now once I create that dashboard, you'll see it's presented there. If I open it up, it's empty. So what I need to do is find data to put onto that dashboard. So I'm gonna go into my streams here and you can go to search or wherever is most convenient, but I wanna lock that down to just my NetFlow data of my firewall. So if I click on that data set, it'll open it up. And I want a couple of them just to show you quickly how to do this. The first one I wanna look at is bytes. I wanna know bytes in and out of my firewall. So I'm gonna go ahead and click, open this menu item up and say, show me a chart of that data. All right, well, if this is interesting, but I want a little bit customized there. I wanna change that into more of a, a sum of all that data. I wanna make it a line chart. I wanna keep that resolution by the minute. But right now, instead of in the last five minutes, I want that to be an eight hour chart. So I'll click that, click search. You'll see that this is gonna get changed. Now you can see a couple large spikes in there. I'm gonna go ahead and add that to a dashboard and put that on my firewall overview. And then I can give it a name and say bytes transferred. And go ahead and create. And we'll then inject that on that dashboard over there. And maybe as well as I want um, uh, something around which country am I going to. So here's a geolocation of where all these logs are going to. So I'm gonna say, click on that world map. I'm gonna zoom that in just a little bit. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add that to the dashboard too. And I'll leave it as titled map. Go ahead and create that one. Now if I come back into this dashboards and click on that firewall overview, you'll see that I have both of those now in there. I can unlock this dashboard and drag and drop these around however I can also update these in the background. So what this is gonna do is constantly refresh the data. So when you open up this page, it'll research the data to make sure it's the most current data there. And then when I'm done, I'm gonna go ahead and lock that down. Now you can customize these and add them as many as you want to these dashboards. And then when you get done with those, you can also assign those to individual users so they can all have that same view of the data. Hopefully that shows you how easy it is to create a dashboard to view that data and the different types of widgets you can create. Happy logging.